I had a friend tell me she was a constitutionalist. That's weird. Today is December 14th, and I kind of had a random thought come to my mind. What is a constitutionalist? Yeah! Go and get me some! Uh -huh. So in trying to find out exactly what a constitutionalist is, I went to a website called wisegeek.com. I will leave a link below so you can read all the information I'm about to read. A uh, constitutionalist is often known by the other names such as a constitutional conservative or a strict constitutionalist. While the later term typically refers to judge or justices, it is also used to describe any person that believes in strict reading of the Constitution. A constitutionalist favors limited government as prescribed by the Constitution. In the beliefs of the constitutionalists, such a government should be small not only in size but also in the scope and in power. So later I was confused to find out that she's a supporter of Obamacare. Now, when just reading that, we saw that constitutionalists believe that the, there should be a strict reading of the Constitution and that there should be small government, because when there's bigger government, there's smaller people. Well, some of you may be wondering why I decided to talk about health care. It's because of the recent decision of one of the Supreme Court judges that the new health care law is unconstitutional. That's not annoying. Now this is annoying. Yeah. When trying to find out a little bit more about what constitutionalists believe, I went to constitution.org, and I'll leave a link at the bottom of the video so you can read some of this in information for yourself. But if you go and you're looking at it, and you look in line 11, it says, It is unconstitutional to impose a tax for a regulatory or a configuratory purpose, or for any other purpose other than raising of revenue. And did you know, by the year 2016, your personal income, if you don't have Obamacare, if you don't have some form of health care, your personal income will be taxed 2.5% more than it already is, or you'll be given a fine of $695. The ears of a true constitutionalist would fringe at that idea, the idea that their money is going to be taxed more because they're not buying in to the health care, that they're not obeying them so they have to pay more. Now, as constitutionalists, you think that we should look to our founding fathers, the true constitutionalist, about what they would do about the health care law and what we should do about it. Charity is no part of the legislative duty of the government. I cannot undertake to lay my finger on the article of the Constitution which granted a right to Congress of exceeding, on objects of benevolence, the money of their constituents. James Madison Unless we put medical freedom into the Constitution, the time will come when medicine will organize into an undercover dictatorship and force people who wish doctors and treatments of their own choice to submit to only what the dictating outfit affirms. Dr. Benjamin Rush, a signer of the Declaration of Independence. That some should be rich shows that others may become rich, and hence is his just encouragement to industry and enterprise. Let not him who is houseless pull down the house of another but let him labor diligently and build one for himself. Abraham Lincoln. Although not a founding father, still an awesome quote. Just by listening and reading a few quotes by our founding fathers, we can tell that they would be completely against this new health care law. In fact, they would believe that it spit on the very document that they used to build this entire nation with, the Constitution. So how can we consider ourselves constitutionalist when our very founding fathers who wrote the Constitution would be against it? But I want to know what you think. Leave a comment or a video response below and tell me, how do you feel about the new health care law? Yeah! Oh my gosh, I am so sorry, Mom. 
And just to clarify, the person that I do mention in the video, I absolutely love to death. She is awesome. I talk to her all the time. I don't hate her. Like I said, I love her. She is uh, fantastic, and I wish the best for her and all of her political views. I just really want to make this video because I hate the healthcare law. Yeah, that's about it.